Yo, what's going on guys? It's Firekiller258 and today we're going to be showing you the best powder grinding method in Hypixel Skyblock for, uh, you know, the crystal hollows and stuff like that and to get your powder up for your mining gear and your heart of the mountain tree. So let's get straight into it with the heart of the mountain setup that you're going to need. It's preferable if you have heart of the mountain 7 mainly because all the good stuff is at the top. So you pretty much need heart of the mountain 7 to, you know, powder grind more effectively so you can actually get like gemstone powder so make sure your heart of the mountain seven to start off with and uh pretty much just copy my heart of the mountain tree mainly great explorer though is what you need on the heart of the mountain tree because it gives you 96 percent chance to find treasure which is a little chest they open for um gemstone powder and mithril powder and you need to upgrade mold because it breaks like so many blocks when you mine one and for your setup, I'll show you guys in a second, but pretty much just copy my heart of the mountain tree. I suggest upgrading mining speed because there's not really much you can do with, uh, you know, mithril powder when you're trying to, you know, powder grind. But you can upgrade efficient miner. I'm pretty sure it works. I'm not entirely sure. And of course, max out your daily powder. Um, but yeah, just copy my heart of the mountain tree. It's four up, two to the left. And then if you go upwards, it's pretty much like a little king sort of thing or like a little crown. And uh, yeah, so pretty much for the setup, what I'd suggest is you can pretty much wear any gear. I'm wearing the maxed out setup, but like you don't need to have this setup. You can use Sorrow, um, you can use even like pretty much anything to powder grind. It doesn't really affect your chances at all. But what you do need is you need to get a gemstone gauntlet, mainly because it can break any block in the crystal hollows pretty much. And um, it has a good amount of mining speed as well. And it doesn't use fuel. So it doesn't use any fuel um, like this drill. This drill uses fuel when you break stuff. But uh, if you have a gemstone gauntlet, it doesn't use any fuel at all. So, yeah. Anyways, I'll show you the gemstone, uh, like, you know, powder method. So pretty much all you have to do once you get those upgrades is you just have to kind of go around in like a little circle until the chest spawns. Once the chest spawns, you wait and you high like hover over the little like X's and then bam you get powder. So I just got 780 mithril powder and 150 gemstone and that's going to build up really quickly. So we're just going to keep doing that and get a lot of gemstone powder. But this is pretty much the best method. Um, I'd also recommend being in the jungle biome as I'm in the jungle biome like in uh you know the crystal hollows mainly because this can also be a money making method as well because you know sludge juice sells for a lot and you can get sludge juice out of these chests so when you're mining in the jungle like this you can actually get sludge juice on the chest i would try to show you an example if i can get one so you just hover over the little x's and then bam we didn't get sludge juice but we're going to keep going until we get sludge juice because you make a lot of money it's the best um in the precursor you can get our uh, robo parts they go for a lot, and oh my gosh, I just got 3.7k gemstone powder. That is so much from mining, so little. And um, yeah, this is just the best method, in my opinion. I mean, there we go, we got sludge juice. Okay, there we go. We got a lot of powder and some sludge juice. So pretty much what the sludge juice is, is stuff you need it to upgrade to, uh, your set and stuff and make gemstone mixture. Whoops, I did not mean to do that. And yeah, it sells for so much. Just 10 sludge juice gives me 13k coins, which is insane. It's over a thousand per sludge juice, which is awesome, guys. I'm telling you, it is crazy stuff. So when you mine here for like hours and hours, you can make like 3 mil an hour, maybe more. Um, just doing this, it's actually insane. So yeah, getting your gemstone powder up the most effectively. And you're also getting like, you know money in the background it's amazing i mean it is pretty boring but once you do it for hours you can actually get a lot of gemstone powder like so much more than you can get from just mining regular mithril and mining regular gemstones if you just do this all day and open up a bunch of chests you can make money and you can get a lot of gemstone powder which is a win-win situation but yeah hope this did help if you are new please be sure to subscribe if it did help you um thank you all for watching and i hope you do enjoy and uh, yeah, have a good one. Please subscribe and uh, comment your favorite thing.